For my best and most trusted CAD adjuster resources, software, and gear, go to adjustertv.com slash resources. In this video, I'm gonna show you the ARM-1 Augmented Reality Laser Measuring Tool, what it can do, and if it will change the way you run field claims, starting now. This is Adjuster TV. Hey, it's Matt here with Adjuster. Hey, it's Matt. Hi, it's Matt here with Adjuster TV and for the best tips and tools for getting on the first call list as an independent adjuster, why don't you subscribe now? Click on the bell notification so you never miss a video. Wanna know how you can survive your first ever storm deployment? Check out the how to survive your first storm deployment webinar. Register for free at adjustertv.com slash thrive. And thanks to Kevin who sent me an email asking, thanks so much for your review of the Catman 2 and Bully Bag Ultra. Do you prefer one over the other? Thanks for watching, Kevin. Both of these toolkits are made with the highest quality materials and well thought out design and engineering, but they are each their own take on the common adjuster problem of how to carry all this crap around on roofs. Both of these tool belt, tool pouch systems have their advantages and their uses for a working adjuster, and I absolutely recommend them both for field use, and I have them both in my truck. Check out the featured videos for both of these products in the description below. Okay, quick disclaimer. The guy over at arim1.com sent me this to review, so I didn't buy it. I'm also not an affiliate or anything. According to ARIM-1 marketing copy, to achieve high-level accuracy, ARIM-1 uses a series of sophisticated technologies including virtual 3D coordinate system, phase shift laser measurement, characteristic point tracking, augmented reality, and our own patented algorithm. Patented, patented, patented. Sounds like I need to put on my Spock ears to use this gadget. So what does all that lingo mean for us as cat adjusters? I mean, what does this little tiny thing do anyway? Let me open this up real quick, super fast. The one I got came in this box here, which is in a smaller box here. And this is it, man. On one end, there is a laser with a little eyeball on it. And then there's uh, on mine, this, this plugs right into my iPhone, but you can get adapters for it. There's a little tiny USB thing for your charger. That's a little micro USB. It's pretty cool. You download the app, you plug this little tiny thing into your phone, and then pop open the app here. And we're going to calibrate. So I turn this thing on, plug it in. So here's the gadget. You can turn it on with this button here. I have to hold this over here so I can see. All right, so then the laser's on. And then I'm gonna plug it into the side of the phone with that. And there you go. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to, what you call it, calibrate. Make sure the dot is within that area. So you can see the dot there. Calibration completed. And we can do a straight line. So obviously I'm a property adjuster, so we're gonna do this on a house. But here, we're gonna go ahead and drop this to this. Cause you know what? I wanna know how far that is. That's exactly three feet right there. And then I can clear that. I can do a circle which I think is pretty cool. So one point is there. One point is here. And one point, I think really can be anywhere, but it's gonna be there. So that's the third point. And there's my circle. It has a diameter of one and a half feet. Uh, radius is three quarters of a foot. And the perimeter is four and seven eighths feet. So let's change the this to architectural. Clear that do this again so this is easier for us to understand one two three okay that's better one foot seven and seven eighths inches as uh, a diameter the perimeter is five foot two two and three eighths inches okay pretty cool so to take a 3d photo we have to give this thing some reference here And then we're gonna back her up, keep my spots in there so I can see the whole elevation. And then hit the photo. All right, so there's my photo. From here, after we take the photo, we go into folder, there's the picture, and then I can pretty much just stand here in the yard uh, or back in the inside the truck and drop my 
uh, measuring points on there. That's about two foot tall by, we'll say two and a half feet wide. And you can click and drag or point and drag with your finger. These, so you can stretch it out however far you want to. Um, which is hugely, immensely valuable for us. Maybe I want to get that this rafter length, right? So maybe I don't need to look at the roof, I only need to look at this rafter. Ten and a half foot, right, give or take. So that'll, that'll save me a lot of time having to either guess that or, you know, breaking my ladder out anyway and just, and just going up and getting that measurement by hand. So um, super valuable. I mean, you can even get your... your uh, your elevation dimensions so this one is about 14 foot by you know 10 foot ish so and then you have your here's another one it's super valuable to have and it's always really challenging to get is getting up inside of here and getting this distance three foot one right for this gable end um, having this kind of functionality here, this this is a massive time saver, and it's, this is the the thing that really, really, really excites me about this particular application. And laser is getting these measurements that are hard to get, uh, that are that are hard to get in the field. Um, if I have direct access to something like a floor plan, you know, the ground inside of a building or whatever. I'm just gonna do, do that by hand. It's, it's, it's a lot faster for me to do it that way um, instead of having to like click on things and oops, I messed that one up or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then having to export an image from this and then import a uh, import that image into, into Sketch and then you know try to build my estimate that way. I'm gonna take my measurements directly from my laser, my regular Hilti laser and put them straight into Sketch and then I'll build my, my interior estimates as I go. That for me is hands down the absolute best feature of this particular app. And I'm sure that the other features will become faster over time. Um, but for high speed claims handling in the field, especially on cat, especially when you're doing exterior stuff, being able to access, you know, get measurements of things that are really, really challenging to access. I mean, look at that. You wouldn't want to set your ladder on that to try and grab that measurement. You know, technically you could measure the exposure of that, the wood pieces on the siding and then count them up and then get back out, you know, 12 inches. But doing, you being able to do use this thing here, I mean, this is like super duper fast to be able to do that. And, you know, getting window measure dimensions, right? Two and a half by two, that's four. That's, you know, that's a small window. So Xactimate isn't gonna have like exact dimensions of windows. It's gonna have like small, medium, large, extra large. Why is that such a big deal? Because if you've ever done any hail claims ever, you have had a house or commercial building with a massive like walkout rear elevation that's three stories and it's covered with metal frame windows. You can see that they're all dinged up all the way up to the top. But even if you wanted to lean your ladder up against that wall, you probably couldn't get accurate measurements anyway and it would take you all day if you could. Enter this thing. Now I can take a snapshot of that huge elevation and then go and sit under a tree and tap out those windows to get the measurements. Boom, done. Will this little thing replace my tape measure for most work? No, I'm still quick draw McGee with my old tape and laser and can have a roof diagrammed and measured before Captain Kirk can even get his phone on, find the app and get it up and running. It also won't replace my regular laser for regular interior work. However, <laughs> For getting hard to reach measurements like those windows, gable end measurements, and, a, and roof pitch angles, dude, this is a game changer for sure. And I would pay way more than they're asking for something like this to speed up getting those tough measurements. Oh yeah, how much is this thing anyway? You can get the gadget in a sweet pelican-like hard case for $199 right now at arim1.com. Go get one. Question of the day. Are you going to the Xactor Elevate user conference in February? Do you want to? This does not include travel or hotel or food or anything else. You have to get yourself to Salt Lake City and feed yourself and all that. But if you win, you've got a free ticket into the conference. You will be an attendee. There's no excuse not to go to this conference in general. And if you win, I mean, it's a no brainer. There's Xactimate certification training, as well as a ton of continuing education, plus keynotes and presentations and panels by industry experts 
including me. So head on over to adjustertv.com to enter. For much more information about crushing it as an independent adjuster, head on over to Adjuster TV. If you got value from this video, you can help me create more videos just like this by subscribing to Adjuster TV on YouTube. Wondering what to watch next? There are tons more videos right here on the Adjuster TV YouTube channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching and have a great storm.